Yo, YouTube, today we finna be reacting to some stuff about Nephilims, and this lady on the plane, she may have just saw one. Nephilim, are they real? The offspring of fallen angels and humans. Are they real and are they here today, right now? The answer is... Well, we finna get into it! <laughs> it's yes. In the days of Noah, why do you think God baptized the earth with water, killed everybody on the earth. You know why? Because there the was Nephilim's. so much sexual immorality. Not only the Nephilim, but it was a whole bunch of young going. It was a whole bunch of crazy stuff. So much wickedness, homosexuality, all types of uh, crazy stuff, the pedif the LGBTQ. Look, nothing's new under the sun. It's been happening. Yes. This LGBTQ stuff, this isn't new. It's been happening. Since the days of Noah, why do you think now now we're, it, we're, it's like the days of Noah? Because back then it was bad. Fallen angels were having were, were having sexual relations. The Bible says the sons of God, and we're not talking about us as sons of God. We're talking about the angels that were created by God's sons, right, of God. Go read mm. your Bible, book of Genesis. They mated with the women, and they created offspring look let me tell you something it gets deep i'm gonna release this because the body of christ needs to wake up and become spiritual minded some of you gonna say ah oh, he's false teaching false prophet i don't care i know this is the truth and i'm a i'm a i'm a ask that you seek and you shall find before you try to say this is wrong look in in voodoo and witchcraft i know this because i studied it i was in it they have what's called spirit spouses they have ancestral spirit weddings literally i was offered that by a woman voodoo priestess which is called a mambo go, go look it up she told me that i needed to get married to a spirit spouse a woman a, a spirit a, sp a female spirit yeah bro this stuff is real bro right which is supposedly an ancestral spirit and she told me that she was married to a spirit spouse, a man, but mm. also had a husband in the physical. And she said, in order for that, that, that ancestral spirit, which is supposed to protect her, to be pleased, she had to literally sleep with that spirit weekly. She had to bring food, have dates. That spirit would literally have sex with her, rape her. This is deep. I'm getting real with y'all because this is some real stuff. The body of Christ needs to wake up and understand this ain't no joke. What y'all think about this? Me personally, I already know and believe that this is real. But let me hear y'all thoughts in the comments. Mm -hmm. So, it's real. It's very, very real. Look, things in the spiritual happen before in the physical. Satan cannot create new things. So Satan can manipulate and pervert certain things. What do you think cloning is? Y'all think cloning is fake? Bro, they've cloned animals. They've been doing it. That's facts, though. You don't think they, can do, you, they can't do humans? They've been doing it. They've been cloning humans. You don't know, bro. Look, why do you think? Now, I'm going to get even deeper. Why do you think the Bible says you must be born of water and spirit? And then after that, it talks about a mother's womb. Because the Bible's, because Jesus knew even back then that you must be born of a mother's womb, water and spirit to inherit the kingdom of heaven. Why? Because there's people that are literally not born of a mother's womb. They're not born of water. Y'all, I done heard some stuff like this. Like, bruh, I done heard some like, y'all know how they be, be talking about the people and like the elite and all that junk. They be talking about the reptilians and it's a whole bunch of craziness, bruh. But I already know for sure. People people do be getting cloned, bruh. I already know people do be getting cloned. For, it's probably like facts, bruh. They're created. By the devil, clones, soulless beings. Where do you think the spirits of the Nephilim went? So when these fallen angels slept with the woman of the earth, the humans, where do you think their offspring went? It stayed on the earth because they can't be judged. They can't go to heaven and they can't go to hell yet. So they stay on the earth. They literally stay on the earth. And those are the demons, the Nephilim, some people pronounce it, the Nephilim, those are the demons we cast out of people. And the fallen yes, angels. fallen angels too. Yeah. But there's, there's only a specific amount of fallen angels, right? Fallen angels can't be everywhere at once. So most of the time, it's Nephilim we're casting out. Look, 
There's people walking around right now. I'm going to get real, man. He's getting deep. I don't deep. care what people want to say. They can say whatever. This is real. There's people walking around right now that are soulless. They're just spirit and body. They're demonic spirit and physical body. They ain't got a soul. They ain't got a soul. It's getting deep, bro. It's getting deep, bro. It's getting deep. They're not going. They can't go to heaven or hell. Mm. And you might think they're humans. Look, some of you got discernment. Some of you are very prophetic and have the gift of the seer and you can see in the spirit realm. And some of you know this already just because of the gift that God has given you. You've seen them. You know what I'm talking about. It gets real. I don't mean to freak nobody out. I just want to keep it 100. I've known this for a while now. I knew this before I even got saved. Mm. And in Christ, it just became even more real. It became more illuminated. Bro, there's people out there that, that the devil's using. Demons can... You don't think demons... You don't think demons could be in a physical form? Come on, bro. What do you think a shapeshifter is? This is why people, look, let's get deeper. People that have dreams or encounters with their ancestors and they think it's their actual dead grandma, dead grandpa, dead whatever, that ain't your grandpa and grandma, bro. <laughs> That's a shapeshifting demon. <laughs> my wife, before she got saved, had an encounter with a demon that shapeshifted into my image trying to have sex with her. Right when I got saved and got delivered from the spirit of of, of um, incubus and succubus, I, I know this. this for a fact. I I've seen this. them shape shift. They can shape shift. They can shape shift into whoever they want. They yeah, can... I know, bro. I, I know that, bro. I literally it, it was caught on video. Y'all know that flood. Y'all know that flood. That real bad flood that happened in Brazil after they was mocking Jesus. They were doing a whole bunch of craziness. They was literally mocking God. They had like. This dude dressed up in a costume as the devil, and you had somebody dressed up as Jesus or whatever, and the devil was acting like he was beating up Jesus. It was craziness. And a couple days before that, a statue of Jesus, that little thing, it was struck by lightning in Brazil, and then they had that parade. And then it was a massive flood, and during that massive flood, it was something caught on video of the flood. And it was something like a, it was like a glass or like a clear, like a clear glass or whatever. And then it shape shifted. It fell down into the water and turned into like, it was like, it turned into like some black figure or some, I don't know how to explain it. All I know, bro, they was like, this is an unclean spirit that was like operating in these people. Uh, it was some, I don't know, bro. Y'all have to see the video, y'all. So what I'm about to show you guys, some of you are going to write off and call it fake. But this TikToker had made a video about the floods in Brazil. And I don't think he even realized what he had captured. Now, I want you guys to keep your eye on this area right here. You're about to see a full-blown demonic spirit that was caught on film that had shape-shifted itself into the image of a door. You can actually see a face if you look close enough. You're going to actually see it leave its position of where it shape-shifted and go into the water and disappear. You don't think that the spirit realm is real? Well, this video might change your mind. Oh, and remember, this happened after the demonic parade that took place in Brazil. Full-blown demon. It's time to get right with Jesus Christ. Comment your thoughts on this video and follow for more, and I'll show it to you one more time. Come in your dreams and shape shift into your ex and try to have sex with you, and you think that everything's fine and dandy. No, that's a demon trying to make you think about your ex to get you to probably commit adultery on your husband or wife or to get you to fall into fornication. Mm. And then you thinking, oh, I'm supposed to get married to this person. No, that's why you need to make sure you back up every one of your dreams with the word of God, with scripture, Fence. prayer, making sure that it's from God. Because there's dreams from God and there's dreams that are not from God. You need to make sure. But shapeshifters are real. And if they can shapeshift in the spirit, best believe they can shapeshift in the physical. There's real beings. You think, so let's talk about aliens. Aliens, you think they're fake? They're real. Extraterrestrial beings are demonic beings, bro. Bro, y'all know the government just came out with this at least like five days ago talking about aliens are real now, bro. The government said it themselves, bro. It's confirmed by the government that aliens are real. Now we know, now we all know that they ain't come from out of no space because space don't exist. It's literally just the earth, the firmament, and the waters above the firmament, heaven, and all that other stuff. You get what I mean? Eh? Space don't exist. It's the firmament over the earth. We can't leave the earth. We don't know. You can't leave the earth. Y'all want a full video on that? Comment down below and let me know. I already know y'all DM me on Instagram. A whole bunch of y'all told me y'all want that video. If y'all want that video, get this video to 150 likes. Hit that notification button, subscribe, and I'll do the video. But yeah, for real though, bro. They said that aliens are real. 
we know it's some type of demonic creatures and it's a whole bunch of it's a whole bunch of spiritual stuff. Like we know the spiritual world exists because the spiritual world caused this physical world to come into existence. God is spirit and he created this physical realm. You get what I mean? So the spiritual realm is more really than the physical. You get what I mean? It's a whole bunch of spiritual beings and a whole bunch of stuff going around in America right now. Y'all heard about the alien, the aliens in Las Vegas, Area 51. It's a whole bunch of Nephilims. People saying junk on planes. People talking about they on on inside of a time loop inside on planes. It's a whole bunch of it's a whole bunch of craziness going around in this world, bro. Subscribe though, so we can hit ten thousand subscribers by the end of this year and get this video to one hundred and fifty likes. If you want that video explaining the shape of the Earth and how space not real, it's a whole bunch of stuff. So comment down below and let me know. I already know y'all want the video, so get the hundred, so get the video to one hundred fifty likes so I can drop the video. Get what I mean? Yes, sir. Now back into the video. Demonic. They're from Satan. Mm. And they're going to come in the future times. I believe this. They're going to come in later times, probably soon. And they're going to start convincing people Whoa. that it's okay to be extraterrestrial. It's okay, this and that. And, oh, they're our friends. And, and they're making people like, bro, I'm telling you, it's going to get weird. Heck no. We are in the days of Noah right now. No cap. Look at the LGBTQ community pushing that agenda on our children. On kids? Going into, going into elementary schools, men dressed up as women, doing drag shows, shows stripping, but like half naked. To these these little four and five and literally six and bro he not making this junk up this is real stuff real stuff bro seven and eight year olds that's demonic bro we are in the days of noah so mm. i want y'all to watch this video to the end it's a woman on the plane this is this is obviously probably not not a holy ghost filled woman she was cursing up a storm we're going to make sure we bleep it out so you guys don't don't hear the curse words but you you get the picture and she encountered a shape-shifting being on the plane so watch to the end don't scroll away this woman claims she saw a shapeshifter on the plane and someone else on board agreed with her i'm telling you i'm getting the f off and there's a reason why i'm getting the f off and everyone can either believe it or they cannot believe it i don't give two f but i am telling you right now that mother f that f back there is not real the person she's talking to is the man in the green sweatshirt on the top left of your screen. He immediately demanded to get off of the plane as soon as she encountered this man before they took off. And I know what you're thinking. This sounds wild. They're real. They're real. They're real. Tell y'all, bro, a whole bunch of people encountering like a whole bunch of spiritual beings. I'm telling y'all, they saying they saying aliens. People saying people not real now. Like, bro clones a whole bunch of craziness that's going around in this world you can say whatever you want but there's no reason to be scared look why 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 do we have no fear because in christ we have more power exactly jesus gives us the authority to trample over snakes and scorpions in his mighty name we got authority over all clean unclean spirits in jesus name if you enjoyed this video comment down below and let me know leave a like and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get a notification every single time i drop a brand new video and subscribe because we trying to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year and if y'all would like to support this channel it's way to support down in the description below and if you would like to get these videos up to seven days earlier and you get exclusive content from your boy christian mims consider joining the patreon down in the description below for only eight dollars a month and i'll see y'all next video